table. Put the bag of coins back in the coffin. Maybe it'll open up the door again. Good idea. Right. This is not my idea of going to the chapel with you. You have a cell signal? Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Well, then the letter was right. Peril and woe to him who follows this path with a dark heart. This is it. Kepo, we're not going to die in here. Here, you saw how thick those walls were. They're made of stone. We can yell and scream all day long. No one's going to hear. It's not like they stocked up this place with supplies. And what's going to happen when we get tired of eating candle wax? No, we're going to get out of here. There has to be a way out. OK, yeah, you know what? You're right. All right this is just Theodore Rose testing us. There's got to be another clue, another puzzle. Something to do with his name. What if, what if it's an anagram? Theodore Rose is heed or toes? No. Theodore Rose, he do rooster. <laughs> it's inappropriate. OK. Deer shot Oreo. Oh, they didn't have Oreos in the 1600s. Castle, there might be another way out of here. I'm all ears. Susanna's killer knows that the half dimes are still in here. Eventually, he's going to have to come back to get them. He must be somebody who knew they existed in the first place. Someone who knew all of this was real. And who better than the person who wanted everyone to think that this was just a game? Nolan, Nolan Burns. Burns, the director of the Historical Institute. Castle, I've got bars. Finally. Espo, you need to get to the chapel now. And tell Ryan to pick up Nolan Burns. 